Huawei has just dropped a bombshell on the tech world with Harmony OS Next. Imagine a world where Huawei devices operate entirely free of Android, introducing an entirely new self-reliant ecosystem that promises to redefine the smartphone experience. But is this bold move a breakthrough or a gamble? Stick around because we're unveiling exclusive features that could shake up the industry and a secret capability that might just blow your mind. Harmony OS Next takes personalization to the next level. With version 5.012, Huawei has introduced dynamic switch themes that let you preview and customize your phone's look effortlessly. The new theme gallery is sleek, powerful, and intuitive, giving users endless possibilities to reflect their style. But customization doesn't stop at the surface. The system's tap to share feature through Huawei Share revolutionizes file transfers. Need to share files, folders, or media? A simple tap is all it takes to send them instantly, wirelessly, and securely. Here's where it gets mind-blowing. Harmonios next introduces the Easy Aid Broad app, a containerized solution that allows you to run Android apps seamlessly within Harmonios. Yes, you've heard that right. You can now access apps like Gmail, Chrome, YouTube, Uber, and Netflix without missing a beat. Setting it up is as easy as downloading a 650 megabytes AOSP image. Once installed, it feels like having two ecosystems in one device. And the best part, it maintains app profiles across updates. For instance, Telegram retains its login data even after an update, ensuring uninterrupted usage. Gone are the days of friction between ecosystems. Moving files between the containerized Android environment and Harmony OS Next is now a breeze. This seamless integration blurs the lines between the two operating systems, delivering a smoother and more efficient user experience. Of course, no innovation is without its hurdles. Some apps like Telegram experience notification delays and system animations still need polish, but Huawei is actively refining these quirks, showing their commitment to creating a polished and powerful ecosystem. Let's address the elephant in the room, the global rollout. Huawei's self-reliant ecosystem isn't just a response to US sanctions, it's a declaration of independence. With plans to support over 100,000 HarmonyOS compatible apps by 2025, Huawei is pushing aggressively to attract developers. But competing with Android and iOS on a global scale is no small feat. Convincing international developers to adopt HarmonyOS will require more than just incentives. It'll take trust and proven innovation. Despite the challenges, Huawei's progress in China's domestic market is undeniable, and it's gaining traction in key regions. This isn't just about smartphones. Huawei is building an interconnected ecosystem that extends to tablets, smartwatches, IoT devices, and beyond. Harmonios Next is designed to unify these devices, offering users a seamless experience that Apple's ecosystem can only rival. Imagine your smartwatch, smartphone, and home devices all working together flawlessly. This is the future of Huawei envisions. The level of integration they're aiming for could set a new standard in the tech industry. The road to success isn't without obstacles, but Huawei's dedication to innovation and independence is paving the way for something extraordinary. By 2025, Harmony OS Next could become a legitimate competitor to Android and iOS, especially in regions where Huawei is already dominant. But the question remains, is this bold move a game changer or is Huawei taking too big a risk? Will this ambitious ecosystem attract enough users and developers to challenge Google's dominance? So what do you think? Is Harmony OS Next the future of smartphones or just a calculated risk? Let us know your thoughts in the comments below. And don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit the bell icon to stay updated on all the latest tech trends. We got more deep dives, exclusive updates, and surprises coming your way.